You don't need anyone else to know who you are. And that's how I've always lived, right? So my life is not dictated by outside perception. At 78 years old, the beloved actress and Hollywood icon Goldie Hawn has finally opened up about the actual truth behind her divorce, shedding light on a chapter of her life that has long remained shrouded in mystery. Goldie Hawn has continued to captivate audiences with her charm and wit, yet behind the glitz and glamour of Hollywood lies a story of enduring love, constant heartbreak, and resilience. But I remember people used to come up to me back then and say, oh, giggle for us. <laughs> Keep watching as we explore the intricacies of her relationships, revealing the highs and lows that have shaped her life journey. From the heights of stardom to the depths of personal turmoil, Goldie's story is one of courage, vulnerability, and ultimately, triumph. A Goldie Hawn's Early Life Before we take a look at the revelations made, we first need to understand what made Goldie Hawn the woman she is today. Born on November 21, 1945, in Washington District of Columbia, as Goldie Jean Hawn, she embarked on a life that would be filled with laughter, talent, and an indomitable spirit. Goldie's childhood was infused with a sense of wonder and creativity. Growing up in Tacoma Park, Maryland, she displayed an early penchant for performance. At the tender age of three, Hahn began taking ballet and tap dance lessons, laying the groundwork for her future in the spotlight. Her passion for dance led her to join the corps de ballet of the Ballet Russe de Monte Carlo production of The Nutcracker in 1955. Even as a young girl, she exhibited an innate ability to captivate those around her, often entertaining family and friends with impromptu shows and lively antics. Her parents, Laura and Edward Hahn, recognized her natural flair and encouraged her to pursue her passion for the arts. As a teenager, Goldie's adventurous spirit led her to explore the world of dance even further. Enrolling in ballet classes, she discovered a form of self-expression that resonated deeply with her. In 1964, Hahn ran and taught in a ballet school, having dropped out of American University where she was majoring in drama. Her professional dancing debut in a production of Can Can at the Texas Pavilion of the New York World's Fair marked the beginning of her journey as a dancer. A year later, she began working as a professional dancer and appeared as a go-go dancer in New York City and at the Peppermint Box in New Jersey. The disciplined world of dance became a canvas for her burgeoning talent, and her dedication quickly set her apart. Goldie's charisma and stage presence were undeniable, hinting at the star she was destined to become. The Rise of an Iconic Entertainer The journey to become an icon often begins with a spark of innate talent and a relentless determination to succeed. For Goldie Hawn, her entry into the world of entertainment was nothing short of extraordinary, marked by a series of defining moments that would ultimately propel her to international stardom. In the early 1960s, the magnetic pull of New York City's vibrant atmosphere drew Goldie into its embrace, setting the stage for the next chapter in her artistic odyssey. It was here that she embarked on a quest to leave an indelible mark on the world of showbiz, armed with an unwavering resolve to carve out her own unique place in the industry. During this pivotal period, she made a fateful decision to adopt the stage name Goldie, a choice that would come to symbolize her infectious energy and endearing charm. With this newfound persona, she ventured to California, where she graced the stage as a dancer at the Melody Land Theater, captivating audiences with her magnetic presence and undeniable talent. It was not long before Goldie transitioned into the realm of acting, making her debut as a cast member on the short-lived sitcom Good Morning World. Despite the show's brief run, her portrayal of a stereotypical dumb blonde character showcased her comedic prowess and hinted at the remarkable career that lay ahead. However, it was her role as a regular cast member on the iconic sketch comedy show Rowan and Martin's Laugh-In that truly catapulted her to international acclaim. With her signature high-pitched giggles and effervescent personality, Goldie became a beloved fixture on the show, 
solidifying her status as a 1960s it girl and capturing the hearts of audiences worldwide. As her star continued to rise, Goldie seamlessly transitioned into the world of film, delivering captivating performances that showcased her versatility as an actress. From her Academy Award-winning role in Cactus Flower, to memorable appearances in There's a Girl in My Soup and Butterflies Are Free, she captivated audiences with her magnetic on-screen presence and undeniable talent. In addition to her silver screen success, Goldie also ventured into the realm of television, hosting two memorable specials that further endeared her to fans. Her ability to effortlessly command the stage and connect with viewers solidified her status as a multifaceted entertainer with an enduring appeal. Despite achieving widespread acclaim and accolades, Goldie's career was not without its challenges. A brief hiatus from the spotlight allowed her to focus on personal milestones, including marriage and motherhood, before making a triumphant return with the romantic comedy Western The Duchess and the Dirtwater Fox. The Supreme Reign in Hollywoods. The 1980s marked a pivotal era in Hollywood, and at the center of it all was the incomparable Goldie Hawn. With her magnetic charm and versatile talent, Hawn continued to captivate audiences and redefine the boundaries of her craft. From comedy to drama and even action, Hawn's influence extended across a spectrum of genres, solidifying her status as a true Hollywood icon. Hawn's journey through the 80s was nothing short of extraordinary. It was a decade that saw her rise to new heights, reaffirming her status as a powerhouse in the industry. Her ability to seamlessly transition between comedic brilliance and poignant drama set her apart as a multifaceted performer with an enduring appeal. The decade kicked off with Hawn's unforgettable portrayal of Judy Benjamin in the humorous comedy Private Benjamin, 1980. Directed by Howard Zeef, the film not only showcased Hawn's impeccable comedic timing, but also challenged traditional gender norms in a revolutionary and entertaining manner. Audiences were amazed by Hawn's portrayal of a pampered woman who finds herself navigating the challenges of military life after her husband's sudden death. Private Benjamin wasn't just a box office hit. It was a revelation that solidified Hawn's position as a versatile performer capable of infusing depth into her characters. As the years unfolded, Hahn ventured into the realm of romantic comedy with films like Seems Like Old Times and Best Friends. These movies not only highlighted her romantic chemistry on screen, but also demonstrated her unwavering comedic charm. Collaborating with esteemed actors such as Chevy Chase and Burt Reynolds, Hahn proved her adaptability in a genre that demanded a delicate balance of wit and warmth. However, Hawn's prowess extended far beyond the laughter-filled corridors of comedy. In 1984, she took on a more dramatic role in Swing Shift, directed by Jonathan Demme. Set against the backdrop of World War II, the film delved into the challenges faced by women entering the workforce during the war. Hawn's portrayal of Kay Walsh, a woman working in a munitions factory while her husband was away at war, showcased a different facet of her acting prowess. Swing Shift represented a significant shift in Hawn's career, proving that she could tackle nuanced dramatic roles with the same finesse she brought to comedic performances. Another notable chapter in Hawn's 80s journey was the action comedy Protocol, 1984, where she portrayed Sonny Davis, a cocktail waitress inadvertently involved in international politics. The film not only highlighted Hahn's comedic talents, but also showcased her knack for physical comedy and on-screen charisma. Protocol served as a testament to Hahn's enduring appeal across various genres and her ability to tackle roles that combined humor with action. However, amidst the laughter and poignant moments, Hahn's personal and professional life intersected in unexpected ways during the 80s. Yet her unwavering commitment to her craft and her ability to evolve with the ever-changing landscape of Hollywood solidified her status as a reigning force in the industry. Goldie's tumultuous journey through love and relationships. As an actress, Goldie Hawn has captivated audiences with her charm and talent. But beyond the silver screen, her personal life has been a captivating narrative of love, heartbreak, and resilience. Before the glitz and glamour of fame, 
Hawn's romantic entanglements began with actor Mark Goddard, her co-star in the 1968 film The One and Only Genuine Original Family Band. Their young love was followed by a relationship with singer Spiro Venduras, a member of the Greek band Aphrodite's Child. These early experiences laid the foundation for what would become a series of significant relationships in Hahn's life. In 1969, Hahn took her first step into matrimony with musician and director Gus Traconis. Their brief but meaningful chapter unfolded against the backdrop of the musical West Side Story, where they first crossed paths. However, the challenges faced by the young couple eventually led to their divorce in 1976. Despite the end of their marriage, Hahn and Traconis maintained an amicable relationship, showcasing their maturity and respect for each other. Following her divorce, Hahn's romantic journey continued with relationships with stuntman Ted Grossman, Swedish actor Bruno Winzel, and Italian actor Franco Nero. However, it was her engagement to musician Bill Hudson of the Hudson Brothers that marked a significant turning point in her personal life. Their encounter on a first-class flight from New York to Los Angeles sparked a romance that led to their marriage in 1976 and the birth of their two children, Oliver and Kate Hudson. The marriage encountered significant struggles, ultimately leading to their separation and divorce in 1982. The public scrutiny and media attention surrounding their divorce painted a complex picture with accusations of infidelity, neglect, abuse and control. The custody battle over their children was bitter and prolonged, leaving a strain on the relationship between Hahn and Hudson for many years. Amidst the roller coaster of relationship tangles, Hahn's life took a transformative turn in the early 1980s when she met actor Kurt Russell on the set of the film Swing Shift in 1983. Their undeniable chemistry quickly blossomed into a deep and enduring romance. Their bond resulted in the birth of their son Wyatt in 1986, who would also pursue a career in acting. Hahn and Russell's relationship has defied traditional norms, as they have chosen not to marry. Hahn has openly expressed her belief that marriage does not necessarily cement a relationship, and that she and Russell have found their own path to commitment and partnership. The unconventional approach to their relationship has drawn both admiration and curiosity from the public. It raises questions about the deeper significance of Hahn's previous divorces and the impact they may have had on her views on marriage and commitment. The Revelation At the age of 78, Goldie Hahn, in a candid interview, opened up about her personal life, revealing the intimate details of her past marriages, her enduring partnership with Kurt Russell, and the secrets to her ageless vitality. Hahn's revelations about her divorces shed light on the complexities of love and success in the spotlight of Hollywood. She candidly shared that the root cause of her divorces lay in the inability of her former husbands to cope with her soaring career and fame. Her success seemed to intimidate and threaten them, leading to attempts to control and stifle her ambitions. Hahn's poignant reflection on feeling suffocated and unhappy in those marriages underscores the challenges faced by women in balancing personal fulfillment with traditional marital expectations. The actress's experiences with marriage and divorce have undoubtedly shaped her perspective on love, relationships, and personal growth. Through her interviews, she emphasizes the significance of open communication, mutual respect, and the willingness to evolve alongside one's partner. Hahn firmly believes that a successful relationship demands continuous effort, adaptability, and a commitment to personal growth. Her enduring partnership with Kurt Russell stands as a testament to their shared values of independence, freedom, and unyielding support for each other. Hahn's decision not to marry Russell is a reflection of their strong desire to carve out their own unique path in their relationship. It is a statement that they are committed to defining their love and partnership on their own terms, free from the constraints of traditional societal expectations. This unconventional choice does not in any way diminish the seriousness with which they approach their relationship. In fact, Goldie's love for Kurt has had a transformative effect on her, leading to a positive and profound change in her outlook on life. 
Their bond is nothing short of extraordinary, characterized by an abundance of love and unwavering support for each other. The impact of their relationship on Goldie has been monumental, as being with Kurt has brought out an even more remarkable side of her, one that radiates joy and contentment. Their decision not to marry is rooted in a deep-seated understanding of mutual love and respect, transcending the need for a legal document to validate their commitment to each other. The couple's vibrant dynamic is sustained by their shared sense of adventure, constantly surprising each other and embracing new experiences. Their refusal to conform to societal norms is a powerful statement of their authenticity and unwavering happiness. Beyond the intricacies of her personal life, Goldie Hawn remains a Hollywood legend admired for her timeless beauty and unwavering vitality. Her age-defying appearance is attributed to a holistic lifestyle encompassing meditation, yoga, exercise, and a balanced diet. Hawn's positive outlook on life radiates through her infectious joy and laughter, serving as an inspiration to many. Her resilience, grace, and achievements have solidified her status as an icon, particularly among women who look up to her as a symbol of empowerment and grace. A Philanthropic Force Beyond the Glamour of Hollywood Beyond Goldie's captivating on-screen presence and personal life, Hawn's unwavering commitment to philanthropy and mindfulness has set her apart as a true trailblazer in the realm of social responsibility. Amidst the hustle and bustle of the early 2000s, Hawn embarked on a transformative journey by founding the Hawn Foundation, a groundbreaking initiative that would later evolve into MindUp. This visionary endeavor sought to revolutionize education by placing a profound emphasis on mindfulness, emotional well-being, and mental health for children. Hawn's dedication to this cause has not only left an indelible mark on the lives of countless young individuals, but has also sparked a ripple effect of positive change in communities worldwide. While her name often graces the headlines for her romantic entanglements, it is her steadfast dedication to mindfulness and philanthropy that truly encapsulates the essence of her character. In a world characterized by relentless speed and constant connectivity, Hawn stands as a paragon of intentional living, seamlessly intertwining the principles of mindfulness with an unyielding commitment to making a meaningful impact on the lives of others. For Hawn, mindfulness is not merely a passing trend, it is a way of life. It embodies a conscious effort to fully immerse oneself in the present moment, fostering a profound awareness of thoughts and emotions without judgment. Her journey into mindfulness was not a sudden epiphany, but rather a gradual realization that amidst the chaos of modern existence, there existed an imperative need to carve out space for introspection and connection with the present. Embracing mindfulness has become an integral part of Hahn's daily routine. From engaging in mindful breathing exercises to dedicated meditation sessions, she invests her time in activities that ground her in the present moment. This deliberate practice has not only enriched her mental well-being, but has also shaped her perspective on the interconnectedness of humanity. Through the practice of mindfulness, Hahn has unearthed a deep wellspring of compassion and empathy, recognizing the shared human experience that transcends cultural, social, and economic boundaries. This newfound awareness serves as the bedrock for her philanthropic endeavors, infusing her actions with an unwavering sense of purpose and empathy. At the heart of her philanthropic work lies a steadfast belief in the transformative power of small acts of kindness, each possessing the potential to catalyze positive change on a grand scale. Whether through supporting local charities, volunteering at community events, or spearheading her own initiatives, Hawn channels her energy into effectuating tangible differences in the lives of those less fortunate. Education stands as one of the cornerstone pillars of Hawn's philanthropic endeavors. She ardently believes that education serves as a potent catalyst for social change. Equipping individuals with the tools to break free from the shackles of poverty and inequality. Through scholarship programs and educational initiatives, she endeavors to empower marginalized communities, affording them the resources and opportunities needed to construct a brighter future. 
Her philanthropic footprint extends far beyond geographical borders, fueled by a global perspective that propels her to actively engage in initiatives addressing pressing issues such as environmental sustainability, healthcare access, and social justice. By forging partnerships with like-minded organizations and leveraging her resources, she tirelessly strives to contribute to the collective effort aimed at fostering a more equitable and sustainable world. Notably, Hahn's approach to philanthropy is underpinned by an unwavering commitment to sustainable solutions. Rather than offering temporary relief, she seeks to address the root causes of social issues, nurturing long-term impact. This strategic mindset reflects her dedication to effectuating enduring change, acknowledging that sustainable development necessitates a comprehensive and multifaceted approach. In addition to her financial contributions, Hahn recognizes the significance of leveraging her influence and networks to amplify the impact of her philanthropic endeavors. By engaging with thought leaders, policymakers, and fellow philanthropists, she actively advocates for systemic change, endeavoring to cultivate an environment where every individual has the opportunity to thrive. Furthermore, Hahn ardently believes in the potency of collective action. By fostering collaboration with diverse stakeholders, she champions a unified front against global challenges. This collaborative approach seamlessly aligns with her mindfulness practices, underscoring her recognition of the intrinsic connection between personal well-being and societal welfare. Through workshops and awareness campaigns, Hahn endeavors to inspire others to embrace mindfulness as a catalyst for positive change. Her journey at the intersection of mindfulness and philanthropy serves as a testament to the transformative potential inherent in aligning personal values with impactful actions. By navigating the complexities of the modern world with mindful intentionality, Hahn not only cultivates a profound sense of inner peace, but also actively contributes to the well-being of others. In an era where introspection and altruism often wane in the cacophony of daily life, she stands as a compelling exemplar of how an individual's intentional choices can sculpt a more compassionate and just world for all. Goldie's Family Legacy Goldie Hawn, the iconic actress known for her talent and beauty, has not only left a mark on the entertainment industry, but has also made a profound impact on her children, both personally and professionally. Her unconventional approach to relationships and marriage has influenced her children, Oliver and Kate Hudson, in ways that have shaped their perspectives on love, commitment, and self-discovery. One of the key elements of Goldie Hawn's influence on her children is her emphasis on open communication. She has always encouraged her children to express themselves freely and honestly, fostering an environment where they feel comfortable sharing their thoughts and feelings. This has undoubtedly played a significant role in shaping their own perspectives on relationships, as they have learned the value of open and transparent communication from their mother. Furthermore, Goldie Hawn's commitment to personal growth has also left a lasting impression on her children. She has always prioritized her own happiness and fulfillment, demonstrating to her children the importance of self-discovery and individual growth within the context of relationships. This has influenced their own approach to romantic partnerships as they have embraced the idea that personal fulfillment should be prioritized alongside the pursuit of a committed relationship. In addition to her personal influence, Goldie Hawn's enduring partnership with Kurt Russell has defied traditional marriage norms, providing Oliver, Kate, Boston, and Wyatt Russell, a first-hand example that love and commitment can thrive outside the formal institution of marriage. This has undoubtedly influenced their views on romantic relationships, allowing them to see that unconventional paths can lead to fulfilling and lasting partnerships. Professionally, Goldie Hawn's successful career as an actress has also had a profound impact on her children. Both Oliver and Kate have followed in their mother's footsteps, pursuing careers in the entertainment industry. They have often spoken about the influence their mother's work ethic, passion, and dedication to her craft have had on their own pursuits, 
demonstrating the lasting impact of her professional success on their career choices. Beyond her personal and professional influence, Goldie Hawn's commitment to philanthropy and promoting mental health awareness has undoubtedly shaped her children's values and commitment to making a positive impact in the world. By witnessing their mother's dedication to giving back and raising awareness for important causes, Oliver and Kate have been inspired to follow in her footsteps, using their platform to make a difference in the world. Enduring Legacy Goldie Hawn, the iconic actress, producer, and philanthropist, has left an indelible mark on the world through her extraordinary legacy. Her journey from a carefree dancer on Rowan and Martin's Laugh-In to an Academy Award-winning actress and compassionate advocate is a testament to her enduring impact on Hollywood and beyond. Hawn's legacy is a tapestry woven with the threads of laughter, talent, and a deep commitment to making a positive impact. Her influence extends far beyond the silver screen, reshaping the landscape of Hollywood and paving the way for future generations of actresses to challenge norms and redefine their roles in the industry. As a trailblazing actress, Hawn demonstrated that a woman could be both funny and successful, breaking away from traditional stereotypes. In an industry where female roles often played second fiddle, Hawn was a beacon of resilience proving that humor and intelligence could coexist on the big screen. One of Hawn's enduring legacies is her ability to infuse joy into every role she undertakes. Whether she was playing the ditzy yet lovable character in Private Benjamin or the spirited, free-spirited Judy Benjamin in Shampoo, Hawn's performances were a masterclass in comedic timing and genuine emotion. Audiences connected with her authenticity, and her characters became iconic representations of the spirited, independent woman. Beyond her acting prowess, Hawn's impact goes beyond the glitz and glamour of Hollywood. In the early 2000s, she embraced a new chapter focused on the well-being of children, founding the Hawn Foundation and launching the Mind Up program. Hawn became a pioneer in promoting mindfulness education for young minds. Her commitment to enhancing children's emotional well-being through mindfulness techniques showcased a profound understanding of the importance of mental health from a young age. The Hahn Foundation's Mind Up program, designed to foster emotional intelligence and reduce stress, has reached countless children globally. By integrating mindfulness practices into education, Hahn aimed to equip the younger generation with tools of resilience and compassion leaving an indelible mark on the future of mental health awareness. Her enduring relationship with Kurt Russell, one of Hollywood's most beloved couples, has become proof of commitment and partnership. Blending their families and navigating the challenges of fame with grace, they showcase that love knows no bounds. As the curtains fell on her active acting career, Hahn gracefully transitioned into the role of a producer. Her commitment to storytelling continued through projects like The Banger Sisters, where she not only starred, but also lent her expertise behind the scenes. This shift demonstrated her versatility and dedication to contributing to the industry's creative process in multifaceted ways. Goldie Hawn's legacy is not just a compilation of accolades, it's a living, breathing testament to the transformative power of laughter, love, and compassion. Through her groundbreaking career, enduring relationships, and impactful philanthropy, she has left an everlasting impression on the entertainment industry and beyond. Reminding us all that the true magic of life lies in making a positive difference in the world. Goldie Hawn's legacy will continue to inspire generations to come, leaving an enduring impact on the world. Thanks for watching fam. For a more exciting video, click now on the next video that pops up on your screen.